So, what's up? It's your boy Jonathan Belcher just recording this quick video uh, to give you a quick nugget for those of you who are in Herbalife. It doesn't matter really if you're in Herbalife, right? This really works for any network marketing company uh, because they pretty much more or less work pretty much the same, right? Um, so, those of you who know my story, you know when I first got into network marketing, I failed miserably. I never had any success when I first got started. I was only about 19, 20 years old. Uh, when I first got introduced into the industry. So, you know, I had some friends and family that were a little interested at first, uh, but most of them, they didn't, they weren't, you know, uh, staying true to their word. Most of them didn't join me in the business, to be honest with you. And a lot of that is really my fault, right? I didn't have a lot of the skill sets that I have now. I didn't know what leads were. I didn't know what, uh, you know, how to show the plan. I didn't know how to meet up with people the right way. I didn't know how to talk to strangers and, pro and prospects. Uh, but the good news is today I don't really have to talk to any strangers or any uh, just random prospects, right? Because once you get a good grasp on marketing, right, not only offline marketing, but as well as online internet marketing, because that is, internet marketing is something that's going to take off more and more and that's going to continue to grow as we go on into the future, right? Because we're in the information age. There's more social media sites than ever before. There's more... Um, just ways of communicating with people than ever before. So with that being said, when I first got started, I failed miserably because I didn't understand a few things, number one. And number two, I was only relying on offline marketing, right? But when I got into internet marketing, that was the first time I ever made any money. Think about that for a second. Made zero dollars, right? Got started at 19 years old doing all this offline marketing, I'm talking about meeting up with strangers in the mall, meeting up with strangers in Starbucks, just trying to show all types of random people the plan, trying to show them the products, trying to show them, you know, the compensation plan, how the business can change their life, and all of that effort did not really amount to anything at all. So what changed for me? When I got online, what changed for me is that I started to realize that as people, as human beings, we had this ability to attract those who are just like us, right? We have this ability to share our story with people, right? A story that people can not only relate to, but people can also identify with and people feel connected with as if it's actually themselves going through a similar situation that you may be going through. And that's why more than ever, the internet marketing game is booming. That's why more than ever, if you know how to and learn how to position your Herbalife business online in a way where people can learn your story, right? People can get to know you a little more and you kind of give people a little timeline as to where you are in your life. If you do that over a period of time, infused with you sharing your value, sharing your skill sets, sharing whatever it is that you learned from your network marketing business about the products, about the compensation plan, you doing all of that stuff and sharing all that valuable information in terms of a story with your network, with your audience of people is gonna give you more sales, right? So you wanna start to incorporate your story, incorporate your journey more and more into your business, right? Um, and it doesn't matter what the situation may be right now, right? You may not necessarily like how much you weigh right now, right? But you can use that to put it as a part of your story. It's not something to feel embarrassed about. It's something to share with the world and that will get more people to not only want to join you, but more people will want to buy the products as they see the products that you're promoting or talking about has actually caused positive results in your life. So include your story more. You know, a lot of you know my story. You know that I was failing miserably as a security guard and that's what opened up my eyes to network marketing, right? I was making only $8.50 an hour as a security guard. I was a broke college student at 18, 19 years old and then that's when I got into network marketing made zero dollars, had no success at all, didn't get anybody to join me into the business doing offline marketing. And then fast forward, I got into internet marketing, right? Didn't immediately start to take off, but over the, over the weeks that passed when I first got started, I started to make some money for the first time. I started to sell some products for the first time from offline, from online marketing, right? So a lot of you, you already know that story, right? And then, and then some of you do know you know, the parts of where I did take off at first was on top of leaderboards, and then I hit another uh, situation, kind of like a roadblock, if you will, or a temporary obstacle in my life, if you will, right? And 
Now the vision is much bigger than that, right? At the time, of course, my vision is still to create 106 figure earners within network marketing, within Herbalife and stuff like that. That's still a part of my vision. But really and truly, my vision now is much greater. It's much bigger because I have, uh, I guess you could say a deeper understanding now, right? I guess more wisdom and more clarity on where I'm headed and where I want to do. So now the vision is more so things of on a bigger scale, stuff like stopping suicide, right? Allowing people to be able to make the money they want to make and live financially free. That's another part of the vision, right? Uh, stopping depression, right? You know, uh, allowing people to start to see the, the, the beauty within themselves. Helping you to be able to understand the power that you were God-given naturally on this earth. Helping you to understand how to really focus and, and take hold of your skill sets. Take hold of your passions. Take hold of your talents and create a paycheck out of that. Not only create a paycheck out of that but really create a career create a career out of that where you can impact people's lives in a positive way so now the vision for me is more so about that right and you can see the progress in my videos for example if you're on youtube right now watching this video of me make sure to subscribe to this youtube video make sure to subscribe to my channel um but yeah the vision see as time goes on the vision gets bigger and bigger and bigger and the more you hit your goals the more you reach your goals it really doesn't stop right there's really no point in your career as a Herbalife distributor or any network marketing, any doesn't matter what company you're in, there's really no point in your career where you just stop, right? And you just stop growing, you just stop learning, you just stop taking action. That really doesn't happen. A true warrior, a true entrepreneur, a true businesswoman is somebody who is looking to learn every single day. Somebody who's looking to get better every single day. Somebody who's looking to grow their skill sets every single day. Somebody who's looking to develop themselves every single day somebody who's looking to grow in some way shape or form every single day that's really what it's really about you get what i'm saying so as you go on your journey and as you start to make more money and you start to get more sales you're going to start to see that your vision is going to start to expand right and your vision is going to start to engulf more people in the world it's not going to be such a small vision anymore you're going to have a vision so big where millionaires are going to want to be a part of that right you're talking about a vision so big where college students are going to want to be a part of that teachers professors you know and once you start thinking on this level you start to share your story more and become more open with the world as you connect more with people right you share more of your story through your facebook posts through your twitter posts right through your emails that you send out to your list through your youtube videos you name it you're gonna get to such a high level of sharing your story that people are just gonna gravitate to you and want to work with you. And that to me is one of the most important things that I learned on my journey as an internet marketer, right? Just incorporating my story, incorporating my truth into my business so that you can relate to it. I'm sure you're watching this video right now and a lot of the things that I may have been saying is starting to make sense to you or it, it is making sense to you, right? And I can only give you my perspective and from my experiences. Um, so that's always been my goal to share my experiences to share my perspectives with you to help you to get better results to help you to get better uh make more money to help you to reach your goals quicker than i had to all the shit i had to go through to, to reach my goals right i don't want you to have to go through all the make all the same mistakes i made you get what i'm saying but i will tell you that don't be afraid to share your story with people you don't have to share your story right when you're in the midst of the storm but make sure right after you pass through the storm and you get over the storm, make sure you share that with people. What happened? How you got over it? Where you at now? Where are you headed now? Share those things with people as you take a step, each step of the way on your entrepreneurship journey. Share these little key points and in, in these key, uh, you know, key points in your life if you will, in, in, in your entrepreneurship journey, share it with people, right? Share your story with people, share your events. You, you know, with me, I did the hotel meetings every single week. I did the home meetings every single week. I bust my ass and I failed miserably doing that. Now it's to another level because I understand internet marketing and I can expand my business much faster than I could before. So I share that in my story, right? And I share that in my videos, multiple videos that I've done. Uh, so you wanna share those things with your your people your client base you want to share that stuff with your team you want to share that stuff with your organization to build that culture right so i hope that anything that i've said in this video helped you if you find found anything that i said in this video to be valuable anyway anything that you find 
to be educational to you or inspirational to you, please drop a comment below in the comments.